You know what's challenging in today's world? Protecting your online privacy and security from hackers and scammers. Also difficult? Finding stock footage of hackers that doesn't look like this. Do they all wear hoodies? What do they do when it's summertime? Sweat, probably. The good news is that a record number of veterans are now choosing VA's multi-factor authentication MFA option, verifying your identity through more than one channel, such as a password and a text message code. So, even if one credential becomes compromised, like your kids get your email password, unauthorized users cannot bypass the second authentication requirement. It's like in those action movies where two officers gotta turn the keys for the nuclear codes. That never happens. VA is committed to keeping your information safe and MFA is an essential part of safeguarding veterans' data. So don't skip the MFA step. MFA is the new MVP. Speaking of MVPs, let's talk the Million Veteran Program, where researchers are committed to understanding the relationship between genes and health. Imagine going to your VA medical center and receiving treatments that are tailored to your unique genetic makeup. For example, if you have a gene variant that puts you at a higher risk for heart disease, your healthcare provider can monitor your blood pressure more closely. That's pretty cool. And if you're dealing with depression, your mental health care provider can use your genetic info to get you the most effective treatment faster. This program is one of the biggest collections of genetic and lifestyle information in the world, with over 900,000 veterans who have already joined up. To find out more, or to find out just how easy it is to enroll, visit mvp.va.gov. And now, a tale of valor and craftsmanship from Coatesville, VA, where volunteers and staff wanted to provide an engaging activity for hospitalized veterans suffering from anxiety or PTSD. They launched a wood shop thanks to a generous donation of equipment and volunteers from the local community who share their passion for woodcraft. Recreation Therapy will continue to advertise the free program and hopes it will catch on. You can find more stories like this at news.va.gov. And if you're feeling inspired, contact your local VA volunteer office to see how you can volunteer and make a difference in the lives of our veterans. All right, that's your bottom line up front. We'll see you next time right here on The Bluff.